Hello, welcome to next Celtic session. This time I have a new beer in the Aldi. Memphis Boulevard and grapefruit infused IPA, 6.5% ABV. Well, when I spot it, I instantly uh, thought, well, it is a copy of Elvis juice from uh, Brudel. So I bought it, but I couldn't buy um, Elvis juice. Mm -mm. Nowhere. Uh, I saw the bottle in uh, Lidl's 5.1. I was like, ah, what's this? But really, I wanted a real um, big uh, can of Elvis juice. So I said, maybe in Tesco. No way. I found it in Morrison. And here it is. And also 6.5% ABV. Hip hip hooray. So we have exact comparison. So first I will try a uh, copy um, to have a like fair uh, judgment if I like it or not. And then I will compare with original um, olive juice. Oh, great beauty, nice. Okay, so here it is. Clear, uh, golden, small head, small bubbles. Looks all right. Oh, a nice great beauty aroma. I would even say it's um, Red gray, grapefruit. Oh, nice. Nice, juicy, uh, bold aroma. Well, I like it. Let's give it a try. Cheers. The taste, it's not so juicy. You have a grapefruit taste, definitely. Mild bitterness. Some zestiness. A little bit of um, white uh, albedo, right? Uh, but that's it. Soft. Kind of juicy on the end refreshing but rather like gentle but still quite refreshing beer alcohol is nicely hidden well it's okay with uh, small bitterness grapefruit here of course uh, but yeah it's easy drinking beer you know what it's quite nice. Um, I would not complain, really. For a, a supermarket beer, it's nice. You can uh, have a slight feeling of uh, artificial uh, flavoring here, but you know, for this price, I think it's acceptable. Okay, so let's open now. Uh, Original. <sighs> well, you know what? The aroma from the can it's much, much weaker than this one. Okay, it looks the same, really. The same color. Clear as well. Uh, quite nice head. A little bit of color. Small bubbles. <sighs> Aroma. 
is grapefruity, but on a much lower level than uh, Memphis Boulevard. Maybe it's not so artificial, but much lower, uh, you know, uh, than this one. Taste is much juicier. Uh, but I would say that uh, body is a little bit weaker. There's more soury, juicier um, aspects in this beer. Bitterness is almost not existing. You know what? It's very um, close. It's very close. There are differences. Uh, I would say that original um, Elvis juice is softer. But all this beer is more gravity. So you have to try. I didn't try to be uh, against the weaker version, as I think it's not fair. So if you have original 6.5, it is very close. Yeah, a little bit juicy, softer, you could say weaker in taste. This one is bolder, uh, has more grapefruity albedo. Yeah, um, it's hard to say which one is better. Maybe all this. Uh, because definitely you would say it's a grapefruity beer. This one is grapefruity but quite soft. But you have impression of a little bit more natural flavoring, right? Then here, this one is a little bit more artificial. But it is a tiny difference. Right. So, this is interesting. Definitely. Uh, the price makes this beer more... Uh, how to say it? Attractive. More attractive. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. Memphis Boulevard, it's very, very close uh, to Elvis Juice. Different, but only slightly. And on the price tag, well, clear winner. Well, I hope you enjoyed this um, video as much as I uh, enjoyed uh, those beers. So please like it, please subscribe to my channel. And when you've done it already, hit the notification button and share with the bell. It will remind you about every new video and chance to be up to date. And because of this, you will not miss any new degustations. Cheers.